Hey guys, I got a very good packet from uh, the Bolt Club. This is the packet. So we have got the Bolt charger. Bolt, Bolt, Bolt. Yeah, here it is. I hope you are aware what this is. This is a motorcycle travel charger. I mean uh, from Bolt. And uh, this charger is actually a little bit unique from other chargers. So what happens is there is a unit which you can actually remove from your bike while you are away from the bike. So this is the only charger that has that facility. And uh, we have also got this packet inside the box. So this is basically a packet where you can keep your mobile. So a mobile holder basically. So mobile holder and the charger. So we will install this charger uh, on the Benelli 300. And I think uh, even the color combination also matches the Benelli 300. So let's install that in the Benelli 300. Hey guys, so today we are going to install uh, the Bolt uh, uh, charger uh, in this bike, the Benelli 300. So we have uh, Rohit over here, he will help me in holding the camera and I will fit the Bolt in the Benelli. So guys, we have got the packet here. So. This, this is the logo, the board logo. You can see the pa packet is quite premiumly packed. It's a nice uh, finished packet. So let's keep this aside. We have a small uh, user manual. And this is the charger. You can see very nicely made, well finished, lightweight, plastic one. But it's nice. This is something which you can attach to your bike and you can detach also. Let's keep this aside. Then inside we have okay. The packet is very nicely packed. They have the cable and this is the mounting system and this is the socket basically. So this is the way you just have to connect. That's all and your charge is ready. Here's the USB point and there is a small indicator over here. So that's all about it. So let's now go ahead and mount this wire from uh, the handlebar to the battery point over here inside the seat. So guys the idea is that over here on the handlebar we'll mount uh, this thing. This thing should be mounted here and the cable has to go like this and below the tank and it has to go over here and then here is the battery so to access the battery we have to open uh, the seat that I'll do right away so panel seat is a single piece seat so quite easy to open now here is the battery so there is a plus and minus the wire has to come from there to here so we'll start from that side so that the excessive wire we can keep it inside this. So I'm planning to install this here because this gap is quite good for this thing. So if I put this like this, just make sure that you have to insert this. It should not touch here. If you make it excessive near, then what will happen? This thing will not slot in because this particular thing will touch here. So put little gap so that it doesn't touch anywhere see i think this is the best place to do so this is all set full tight and uh, i can actually slot this very easily this side okay and it's not touching yes it's not touching let's simply remove this now i have to take the wire from here from here I have to take and I have to find out what path will be best to reach there. So guys this is installed now here and the cable I took it from here. You can see from here it goes. I have kept it little loose so that uh, doesn't get stuck when you rotate your handle. And then uh, here it goes like this. Here I have given this. Then here, here, here and we have got this big wire. So we, what we can do is like we can fit this here and the rest of the wire we can simply keep it here the spare wire that's how it is so let's go ahead and put this thing into the battery i'll now open 
these bolts small bolts these two bolts and then i'll put that i have connected the black cable to the negative point and the red one i'll connect to the positive point one thing you have to keep in mind before you connect anything to your battery directly make sure you just try to do this once that there is no sparks because if you the moment if you don't do check this and directly put it like this if there is a short circuit or something this will burn off so therefore just try to put this like this if there is any issue or if there is any short circuit it will spark that means your circuit is not good you have to remove it all right guys so now i'll put this one and then we'll be done with the installation the last step so guys now the installation is done now we have to check with the charger we have got the usb cable we also got the mobile so we'll check how the charging thing works out so just fit this yes and you can see the red light that means this charger is working now it's working great so let's test with the mobile the usb cable here usb cable simply remove them and then put it here like this okay now we'll put it to the mobile phone here we go let's see oh cool you can see here so here it is it's charging so this is done now we'll simply put the seat that's all about the installation this installation is quite simple let's put it here you have got belts just that you have to tie it here and then there you can put the belts that's all guys so this was the installation guide the diy to connect your charger to your bike especially the bolt charger uh, this charger is costing about something from like 1700 to 1900 rupees you can uh, uh, buy this product online i just share the link uh, to buy this product online in the description section of the video or else you can check out this card so so you can click on this card where it will directly take you to the link where you can directly buy this online so that's all about it friends you can share this uh, video with your friends whoever is looking for a diy video on installing a charger or if they are looking to find some kind of information about the bolt charger so you can share this link and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you have not yet subscribed that's all guys have a great day bye bye thank you